Hey everyone, it's Raphael from XX Raphael Productions, and I'm gonna show you how to add in a scroll rect in Unity. So this one right here is a um, vertical scroll rect, but I'll also show you how to do the horizontal one as well. So let's go ahead and begin. All right, so here I am with a brand new project. So if you saw in my example earlier, I had three images. So I'm gonna go ahead and import those three right now into my assets folder. All right, so let's go ahead and create a canvas. So I'm gonna go to the hierarchy over here, right click and select UI canvas. And the next thing we're gonna do is head over to this box over here, this drop down box. It says screen space overlay. Click that and make sure it says screen space camera instead. And now in this empty box over here that says render camera, we're gonna go ahead and drag in the main camera that's over here in the hierarchy. Drag it right in that box right here. And now, once you've got that down, we're gonna go ahead and add in an image. So right click the canvas and go to UI image. Copy and paste that images two and three because in my um, example, I had um, three images earlier. So let's go ahead and resize this image. Oh, let's see, this should be a good size, all right? So let's go ahead and um, resize that and select an image. So I'll do first image, image one, Ooh, that's, image, that's already image one. I'll do image two and resize that. Like I said before, though, it doesn't really matter if it's messy because this is simply a tutorial video. But obviously, if you have your own um, project, you want to polish this as much as you want. So let's go ahead and uh, I'd that's better. All right. So if you go to the game scene and the third image is a bit out of view, th that doesn't matter because obviously this is meant to be a scroll view. I think it makes it a little smaller too. Okay. So now that you've got that down, let's go ahead and right click the canvas and then we're going to go ahead and create empty. Not the empty parent, just simply do create empty. And then what this is going to do, this is going to be the image container. So you're going to name this game object as image contain. And then right over here, make sure this is selected. It's a bit invisible right now, but we're gonna go ahead and resize that box over here until it encompasses all the three images or whatever you're trying to scroll. So make sure that, yeah, yes, I even mean outside the canvas as well. Make sure it um, contains all three images inside, all right? So once you've got that down perfectly, right click the canvas again, Go to UI and select, I'm sorry, go to UI and select image. And well, this image, we're gonna name this one scroll, I'm sorry, area scroll. And this one over here, drag this area scroll onto the very top. So it's gonna be the first one in front of the canvas. So don't worry like about this right now, just simply put that on underneath the canvas. So don't put area scroll outside, okay? Just simply underneath the canvas. And then this right here, we're gonna resize that as well, that white screen over here. But instead of it going outside the um, canvas, it's gonna simply go down to the very bottom. So it's not gonna be like the image container where it goes outside the canvas, all right? So make sure it's simply resized like that. And then what we're gonna do next is head over to um, the scroll area. We're gonna add components, all right? The first thing we're going to search up is going to be scroll rect. And then we're going to search up mask. And next thing we're going to do, okay, so in this content over here, we're going to drag in the image contain. So this very bottom um, image contain right here, we're going to drag the game object into the content box uh, in the scroll rect component, all right? And then the next thing we're going to do is dragging all three images. So these three images we copied and pasted, uh, I'm sorry, drag them into the image contain right here. So that once, if you know that, just to make sure that um you've got it perfectly down, it should have an arrow now. So that means it's inside the image container. And then the last thing we're gonna do is drag in image contain into area scroll. Okay, so just to make sure you've got that perfectly down, look at the arrows and also make sure the images are inside image contain, which is inside area scroll, which is also inside the canvas. So what we've done right here is um, adding these three images, the contents of the scroll rect into an empty game object. Well, it was an initially an empty game object 
into an image that was named area scroll. So now we can actually run and test our game. So click the play button up here to run it and then you can try dragging. So now just to fix this part, you can see that I'm also scrolling horizontally, which we only want vertically. So let's go ahead and um, stop the play button. So simply click that again. And then to fix this problem, what we are going to do is head to scroll, area scroll and scroll over to scroll rect. You can tick horizontal or vertical. So in my case, I wanted to scroll only up and down. So I'll leave vertical ticked. And if I click the play button a second time, it only goes up and down. I can no longer do left or right. So to do it the other way around, let's go ahead and untick vertical and tick horizontal and click the play button again. And now you can see I can do left and right and I cannot do up and down this time. So yeah, that's simply how you do the scroll rect in the 2022 Unity. So hopefully this video helped you out. I actually did get um, a request in my other video that the other tutorial was outdated. So I decided to make this video. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next Unity video. Raphael out.